Hi there, if you would like to create all company owned Windows devices only, this lecture is for you. So simply you could you know, navigate to creating a new group as a dynamic group from all groups, create a new group and give a meaningful name. For example, here I'm just giving all company owned Windows devices and then group membership is the dynamic device and I'm writing the query in this case the device OS type is earlier we have done this as Windows if you remember in a previous video and then this is the first expression and click on additional properties to make this to you know work as an AND case so if you see here you could you know write as an AND or OR case so in our case we wanted all the Windows devices which are owned by company so for that I need to you know, choose as an AND as the expression and then choose the uh, ownership in this case as a company so I'll just say device ownership equals to company want right so you can simply type here as a company owned and this becomes as a device OS type equaling to Windows and device ownership equals to company so this is gonna list out all the Windows devices that are owned by company that's nothing but a corporate owned Windows devices. This is how you could, you know, create the dynamic AD group, which will be very useful when you're working for any kind of you know, software deployment uh, from Microsoft into an you know, endpoint manager. So in this case, if you could, you know, simply look at the, all the devices, that's going to list out here. All, all of these devices are corporate devices from my lab, which is coming as a dynamic membership. I hope this short lecture is useful for you. Thank you for watching this.